Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you like to hear someone talk about their pets, go ahead and hit those like and subscribe buttons down below because it's kind of what I'm here for. I do have a goal of reaching 500 subscribers by the end of the year and I'm getting close and I'm getting excited. So I really, really hope that we're gonna push through and make it. Also, I'm so sorry I did not upload last Sunday at noon. Um, you know, I've consistently done this all year long with the exception of last week and I think one other week. I said I was gonna upload on a day and I didn't so I feel like I'm not doing too horrible, but um, every Sunday at noon, at least until the end of the year, I may change an upload date. I, I've got a lot going on right now, so I may not be able to do once a week anymore. However, it will still be regular and consistent to some extent. Um, today's video is going to be a fun video. Now that we're into October, I'm going to do like a small little things I got my pets for Halloween haul. <laughs> um, I know it sounds ridiculous, but I love decorating my home. And y'all, my dog is like inching into my lap every second. I love decorating my home. So I also like to do small things, simple things for my reptiles, my cats and my dogs, even um, when it comes to Halloween. And any excuse I get to do that, I absolutely will. I do the same thing at Christmas time. I don't know. Those are the two holidays I just love to deck out for. Um, sorry, I've got like Tux, my dog, let me show you, right here in my lap. And, oops. So Tux is in my lap and then I have Keanu over here like getting in his water dish and scratching for attention as well, although he just walked back there. I need to clean his doors on his tank, but back to the video. Okay, I'm also gonna sit like this now, but that's all beside the point. So the first thing that I got, um, I think I found this at Ross, just this little cute black cat hollowed out candy dish that I thought it would be really, really fun to put in the frog tank as like a water dish for the time being. So that is my plan for this. I got at, I think this one is at Burlington maybe. I love to go to those stores to pick up these types of things, but. These are just little ceramic skull dishes. I don't know if it'll pick it up or not, but there's a black and a white one. These are for Keanu also. He's getting to that point to where um, if I'm gonna reach into his enclosure first thing in the morning, I have to have his food ready to go. So um, he has multiple dishes now at this point. He's, he's got a few because I've got to pull one out and put one in at the same time usually. These dishes are super cute too, and I believe I got these at Walmart maybe, but look at how cute this little ghost tray is. I love ghosties, they're my favorites. And then this little pumpkin one, I say tray, but I guess plate. Um, they're so cute. These are great for the reptiles who eat salad, um, like my bearded dragon, or even my uh, sulcata tortoise and my blue tongue skink. Can you stop? Wait. Okay. So then the other thing I got, I got these with my cats in mind because it's going to be hilarious, but a little dinosaur costume that fits over their head and bat wings. I got these at Target. The costumes I got at Target. These eventually should probably be able to fit Keanu and look really cool on him. Um, I'm not really big into dressing up my reptiles, but who doesn't want to put wings on their giant lizard at some point or another and claim to have a dragon because I know I do. Uh, but yes, those are for my cats. My cats actually do wear costumes and they don't have a problem with them usually. I'll try and show you guys. Now this one I got and it's super cute. It says it's a medium. This is a dog costume. The next two are dog costumes. It says it's a medium and it's like a little skeleton from Target. I think I probably got the wrong size and I probably should have gotten a large for Tux, but we're going to see. I feel like because he's already black and white, this is just going to look too cute on him, but we're going to try it on him. And then this one right here I got for my sweet, sweet Delilah. It's just a little candy corn pajama set. Um, she will probably maybe sit out front with us if she can keep her barking down. She is a German Shepherd, so she does bark. Um, so she can keep her barking down. I might have her outside with us for a while on Halloween. And I just wanted her to wear something cute that was light and not super hot and heavy. But let's put some of this into use. If anyone ever wants to know why my dogs hate me, this could be it. Delilah, of course, doesn't mind at all. Oh, 
She's not a fan of the hat. That's okay. That's okay. You don't have to. And then Tux is frozen. He wouldn't even let me <laughs> get that paw in. Delilah, hush. She's whining because she thinks she's going outside, but Tux is uh, definitely not fitting him. Hush, hush. It definitely doesn't fit him, but it would be adorable if it did. So I need to get this off of him. He's so uncomfortable. And my frogs are all currently sleeping because it is the middle of the day, but they're gonna have a nice, fun Halloween cat to wake up to, to take their little baths in. I'm not really gonna show myself putting these plates with their food into their enclosures because they've already, they've already done that today. They've already eaten. But uh, let me see if I can go find my cats and put some costumes on them. And then, of course, I found just the cat I was looking for. He walked out right when I said that. So let's see if he will wear these costumes. It's been a few years since I've put costumes on him. Oh, my goodness. The bat wings are adorable. Let me see if I can get this to where you guys can see it. So cute. And I feel like this one just looks ridiculous. You just look ridiculous with your little dinosaur. <laughs> Anyways, that was today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and make sure that you guys are staying tuned.